Hey, what's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the channel. Real Sports Updates here. Back again with another video. So Kyle Van Noy is now a Los Angeles Charger. Um, and I got to be honest with you guys. I completely forgot about Kyle Van Noy. I completely forgot about him even being available. Um, he was one of those free agents that completely flew under the radar. Um, I do remember when the Patriots cut him, but... Uh, you know and that was what two months ago in march um but he's he's flown under the radar since then you know i don't even know if he if he's had any other free agent visits uh with any other teams but you know when the news broke yesterday um it kind of was like okay this this makes sense um again credit more credit more credit than i've already given to brandon staley tom telesco um you get another another guy who has been in the league for what eight or nine years um he's a, ve a veteran presence uh he is a good locker room guy um he's a guy who understands what his role is um on a team he understands his role on a defense uh and you could not have you could not have made a better signing for the value price that they did um now the contract details were not um readily available yet but but uh, you know, I, I know that he did not know that he is uh, he's not a guy that's commanding a huge salary at this point in his career. So this is obviously a value signing um, to last go again. Right. You get another one of, uh, you know, a, a, another one of uh, Bill Belichick's former uh, pupils, you know, and, you know, you're able to plug him in on the defense that is going to need some depth at the pass rush uh, pass rushing position. Uh, which he he plays and you know again man you, you really cannot say enough um, you know I think one of the things if if you looked if you watched the Patriots especially during their last Super Bowl run um, Van Noy he really stood out to me um, I think he is probably one of the best run blitzing linebackers that I've seen um, if you go back and watch some of the games like his timing on some of the blitz packages that he's in is impeccable. Um, and, you know, I, I noticed a lot of it, you know, towards uh, uh, the run game, you know, he was really good, really, really good in the run game. And he is, he's a guy, he understands uh, what his role is. He understands what he needs to do. It's from, you know, obviously he can, he can bring it off the edge, but I think he did his best work in the middle of the field, like in the A and B gaps. Um, delayed blitzes i seen him do a lot of that so he was able to have a free path to a quarterback to a running back whatever um be able to blow the play up in the in the backfield before it started um he's a really really he's gonna be a really valuable asset to this team to this defense um and again man he, he comes from new england so he did learn how to play you know his position um, and he learned it from the best. So, you know, you obviously, obviously cannot be upset with that. Um, you know, I think he is, I think he's going to do, I think he's going to do a, a, a very good job in, in the role that he's in. Now, hopefully we don't see too much of him on the field. If we see too much of him on the field, then I think, uh, you know, that, that will probably indicate that somebody's injured. But, um, again, at this time in his career, at this point in his career, uh, he knows what his role is and you know he's still you know a linebacker age is is a little um it's it's a little bit in dog years you know he's 31 so you know but you're a linebacker you're dishing out all this punishment and stuff so 31 is you know it, it it's still young enough for him to have an impact um you know on the team so i do think that he is not too old i don't think he's he's, he's too beat up um, and I, I think he can give the Chargers a real, real big boost at the linebacker position. You know, like I said, especially in blitzes. Um, he's also pretty good in coverage too. You know, he, he's got uh, a couple interception in his career. Um, so yeah, man. Just, just again, again, you got to give credit to Telesco. This has been the best Charger off season that I have ever seen in my life. Um, I cannot, I can't think of an offseason that ever um, has even come close to being uh, 
what this has been, man. All of the talent that has been brought in, uh, particularly on the defensive side of the ball. I mean, even on the offensive side of the ball as well. There's so much talent and, you know, the Chargers are going for it. And, you know, this is this is going to be a very, very, very uh, interesting season. It's going to be a very, um, you know, it's going to be a thing that is talked about. You know, if the Chargers have a lot of success, if they do have success down the road, um, it's one of the things that's going to get talked about. All of these moves, all of these free agency moves. It's going to be talked about and you know people are going to point back to the success of this team starting in free agency right starting in march that's where all of the success is going to happen uh or that's where all the success was was uh planned out you know that's where all of the talent was was uh um you know all of the talent was able to to come together in in march and you know hopefully it pays off on the field man this is all of it is great, and I've said it before, you know, but this is on paper. So these guys are going to have to uh, come together very, very fast. They're going to have to be able to gel. They're going to have to be able to, to learn each other's tendencies and stuff. And they're going to have to be able to function as a group, um, you know, one team, one mindset, and all of that, all of that good stuff. But, again, a good, great, not just a good, but a great value signing by Tom Telesco. Um, another philosophy signing by by uh, Brandon Staley. Remember that this this is a philosophy thing. Um, so, you know, we'll, we'll we'll see what happens from here. But you know, I do think that this move is going to pay off for the Chargers. Um, you know, the depth, the 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 veteran presence, the the leadership, um, the knowledge. Uh, you know, all of it is going to you know pay off. And you know, hopefully, it it you know. Hopefully it, it ends up in a deep playoff run, right? I'm, I'm a Charger fan, but I'm not going to be talking Super Bowl right now. It's way, way, way too early. You want to make the playoffs first, and then you want to take it from there. So, um, But we'll see what happens going forward. But that's pretty much all I got for this video, guys. Just a quick reaction to the Kyle Van Noy signing. Um, please, 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 if you are not subscribed to the channel, please consider subscribing to the channel. Um, please leave me a thumbs up for this video. It really does help me out in, in the uh, algorithms. Um, but that's all I got for now, guys. Uh, until next time, I will see you later. Have a good one.